A well-executed breakout is critical to team success. A well-executed investment plan is critical to financial success. Let me develop a plan with your goals in mind. John Moore reporting for sportsandmore.com from the BMO Center, the 2015 East Coast Ice Jam. And I'm joined by Frederick Canadian Center, Mika Sear. Frederick, tell me, Mika, you're not from Fredericton. You're from Edmonton, New Brunswick. But tell me about the decision to move to Fredericton to play for the Canadians. Uh, it was kind of, it was an easy decision because I wanted to play hockey. There was no midget AAA team in Edmonton, so I just wanted to come and play hockey and live my dream. What is your dream? Just probably like everyone else going to the NHL and uh, go midget AAA after in the queue and then uh, NHL if that's possible. But uh, yeah, that's really, that's it. Like, yeah. How satisfied are you with, with your season to date? I'm really satisfied. I didn't know I was going to do well like that because it was like new. It was the caliber of the hockey is really faster. Guys are way bigger than in Bantam. So I adjust pretty well and it's, I'm really satisfied with my season right now. Size, are you listed at 5'8"? Five, five is that? Yeah, I'm, weird. I'm just 5'8 and 155 pounds and I'll try to work on that during the summer, get bigger and stronger. Tell, tell me some of the challenges you face when you're at that size, at this stage of your career. Uh, the battles and like on the boards, you can push like way easier because the guys are way bigger and stronger than you, but uh, like I'm fast so I'm trying to use that to my advantage. The Q draft in June, how much thought do you give to that? Uh, I think it's still early, but I don't know. It's, I just want to get drafted. I don't even care what round am I, I am. What round, what team, it doesn't matter? No, nope. I just want to get drafted. Well, Mike, Mika is a little bit smaller, but again, his game is, is built on quickness, uh, and he is very quick. Uh, he's got uh, great acceleration, great hands, and uh, the good thing about him is his hockey IQ would be above average. And so when you, you, you combine that, uh, you get away from the size factor, and the fact of the matter is uh, he's very strong. So at 5'8", uh, he's physically very strong because he's strong on his feet. And so he wins a lot of battles one-on-one -on -one that, uh, you know, you would think, oh, maybe as a, as a smaller player, he may not. But because of his speed and, and strength on his feet, he's, he's uh, you know, comes out with a puck.